Better. Talking to Robin Campbell in the square in Bratislava, the capital of Slovakia, only 67 kilometres away from Vienna, the two closest capitals in the world. How high are you going to raise the roof at the rainbow on November the 3rd? Um, that high, that high. Yeah, that so you're going to knock the old one off and put a new one on? Absolutely. With your superb do. guitar solos? That's exactly what I'm going to do. <laughs> Well, that's what happens, it's too activated. You know what I mean? You just sleep the day away. Yeah. Sleep the day away and come the evening when you're supposed to be sleeping. Now on board the flight to London's Heathrow, there's a back of the heads of some of the oldest men in pop music today. And <laughs> it's Norman about to give our lead singer a little slap on the back. Not that, just covering his ball patch. Yeah, just the old Norman. It's David's ball. Tell the world Ripping. This is all true, by the way. And then went on to take Bob Marley and the Whalers on their first tours around Europe. He mixed their live at the Rainbow Gig. After that, he became Robert Palmer's manager. And then he inherited us. And that's karma for you. You I know what I mean? Robert Palmer's dad. A life of good stuff, and then us. It's a shame. There's Astro. He's been reduced to reading the Daily Mail. And that's a real sadness. That's a, that's a real disaster. <laughs> it's feeding time on the plane. I've come round with lunch. As you can see, it's really good. The guys have had wonderful seafood salads, Prawn which I'll all tuck nice. it into. How was it, Duncan? Very nice prawn salad. Duncan Campbell, our uh, lead singer, is also a food critic. And as Norman showing us a lovely crispy seafood salad. Not bad at all, I know. It's wonderful. Oh, yeah. And anything to add to it? How's the bread? Nice fresh. Warmed, nicely warmed, and, and the butter melted beautifully on top. That's splendid, splendid effort. You know, it's not bad, people can play it. And with a cheeky little wine. And you're drinking a wine, down. and what's mm -hmm. mm -hmm. a wine in it? It's a little Chianti. A little Chianti? Mm -hmm. How about that? Wash down my flower beans. <laughs> <laughs> I think he was doing a bit of um, Hannibal Lecter then. But it's not bad. Here we are in a pressurised tube flying at 500 miles an hour and the boys are eating seafood salads washed down with Chianti and warm bread. I mean, it can't be bad. And there's a beautiful stewardess coming down again. She's very patient. She's looked after us wonderfully and we'll stick her up on the internet. Thank you very much. And that's a good place. Here we are, live and direct with the beer drinking champion of Jamaica, Monsieur Travisson. Yeah. <laughs> And it's, ah, as, just having a little it is just as simple as that. Like one, two, three. <laughs> Thank you, my brothers. <laughs> Saturday, I don't know who's what team bus we'll get. When we came down, we were on the Chelsea bus, 
which the boys abuse and write graffiti in the toilets. And uh, Paul, any idea what bus we've got today? No. Will it be one of the football buses? It is one of the football buses. I don't, know, I don't know which Premier team we are using today. You're not sure which Premier team it is? No. Let's hope it's not Sunderland. <laughs> Here she comes, the good bus UB40 for the day. It looks like a good one. It could be Chelsea's bus. It could very well be Chelsea's bus. It's a nice one. Here he is. Let's go boys, let's go! I'm going to kill the driver for fun! <laughs> Can you say that again? I'm going to kill the driver for fun! <laughs> 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 